Hey, it's Johnny with Hickory's Nest. How's everybody doing? Jumping right into a lamp project that we have from the old barn we tore down. Uh, this piece, it's really cool. Got some old piece of oak, and I plugged in a couple pieces of walnut, and there's some other associated hardwoods that are set in the middle of this piece. Let's, uh, Let's give this a turn, get the top of it cleaned up. That will just about do it. We'll uh, sand this down a bit. Believe it or not, we're going to go pretty coarse with the first layer of sanding. I'm actually putting a 60 grit on the top of this. Some of this wood's right on the verge of being rotten, if not considered rotten. But we'll hit it with this 60 grit. Then I'll touch it up with a little bit of 220. And then we'll pull it out of the chuck here and kind of play around with it on the workbench with the lampshade and get ready for some clear. One of my favorite parts, shooting some clear. Look how this thing comes to life. So the exotic hardwoods that are in the middle between the pieces of oak will really kick off some vibrant colors. Like that orange from that Paduke. It just, as, as the clear sinks in, it'll just pop. That vibrant yellow is Osage orange. Black on the edge is actually Wenge, which is an African hardwood. So I just like how this just turns into something so cool looking with a little bit of clear. I think that shade's going to fit just right and give it just a touch to set everything off, all the grain lines and the Wayne guy. I think that's going to work. I have got to thank my wife and our quality control manager, Waylon. So this is part one of the lamp. Part two, I'll put out probably here in a couple days with the finishing touches and putting this lamp together. Thanks for watching again.